Alright people, we back. We back. We out the finals. No more contenders tournament. The gold rush. I am Phantom War 2376 and here we go. Benoit vs Samoa Joe. Let's see which one of these two beasts gets to face DDP. And seriously, I hope DDP actually does lose the title because this is what I want to. It's going to be about four episodes long. But I do hope DDP loses the title because this, that son of a bitch has got like three of them. He needs to lose one. Because I don't know if I can strip him of a title. I can't strip him of one. I don't really want to put Brock Lesnar in there, so yeah. Oh! I did classic matches! Well then our superstars did classic match. Oh, oh, oh you people are so good when I think and talk. I need classic matches like Lesnar vs. fucking Angle, Lesnar vs. Benoit, Lesnar vs. Cena. Hardcore match. Anything goes. Mm. Sounds delicious. Yeah, let's see who's gonna win this one. There's the clothesline. Yeah, they gave fucking Benoit fucking Eddie's move set. And the knuckles connect. What a match. Yeah, even the game that was actually Benoit's the fucking cross chop. Where he smacks him across the chest. That's the only thing they gave Ben they gave the creator gave Benoit was a cross chop. Everything else is Eddie. So that goes to show that WWE does not fucking give a two donkey shits about the Benoit family. I mean the cross face anyone can do. But yes, it's not over the top, Samoa. Come on Benoit, fuck this cunt up. But yeah, on a serious note, I'm going to ask you guys this. Do you think if Eddie and Benoit were still alive, they would have made the jump to TNA? Oh, not this. If they were still alive and given how fucked up they were. Because I say, yeah, they fucking would. Because they are one-time champions. <laughs> they were never going to get another opportunity straight out. And TNA would have given it to them. Oh yeah. I thought Samoa tapped out. Oh shit. He didn't. Come on Chris. Come on Chris, you can do it. It's either you or Joe. Joe's 100% 100 bucks. That's the worst part. Then why I think he's like 92. Samoa's 100. <coughs> so I'm basically going to say there's going to be a new champion. But come on, it. come on Chris. Come on, get out of it. Get out of it, bro. Get out of it. Yeah, I'm Chris. Yeah, I think we can. And the referee just runs the fuck away. Oh shit! Well, I might as well just with this episode, just do it. Fuck it. I don't care if it's gonna take fucking longer or not. It probably won't because some old Joe's fucking 100. He is 100. Not this 92, 98, 99, 97, 84 bullshit. Samoa is 100. This next match will be pretty fucking, sm pretty fucking short. It's going to be really fucking short. So let's fucking do it. Let's get it over with. Here we go. 
We are selected arenas for this. Actually, it's getting battleground. His DDP is going to be in for the battle of his life. <laughs> I should really be watching the bottom of the fucking screen, really. The following contest is scheduled for one fall. <coughs> Don't care. Here we go. Here we go. DDP versus Samoa Joe. You can't let DDP win this. I mean, I know he's 50, but come on. Oh, I thought Samoa was a super heavyweight. DDP is like a fucking middleweight. Oh! I know, no, no, no. I don't think Brett will win that anyway. Did I say the old WCW US title? Get Brett to win that and do a classic match with WCW DDP versus um, Bret Hart from uh, World War Three, 1999, I think it was. Hey, you think you would think um? See, as WWE bought WCW and all that, they would have brought in some of the old fucking events. The WCW had like um, World War Three, three rings, sixty men, and I'm pretty sure they got sixty men. Now, that's the funny thing. I don't know how in the fuck WCW did not make money. <coughs> I mean, they had sixty over sixty fucking superstars. How the fuck did they not make money? I mean, TNA is basically what. Smackdown or Raw would have on a normal roster. We're at 20, not even 30 fucking people, no wonder they don't do a fucking battle royal. I mean, how the fuck did WWE beat? I mean, I know they were creating new superstars from WCW and all that, but I mean, WCW had the fucking ability to do the fucking best shows. I mean, they had live TV, they had everything. How did they fuck up so badly? I mean, Eric Bischoff bringing the NWO, that was a fucking stroke of genius. I mean, the LWO... Yeah, it was alright. Fucking the wolf pack. Oh, there we go, new champion. Samoa Joe. Samoa Joe gets the title. But yeah, I mean, WCW should have fucking won and bought out WWE. That would have been a lot fucking better. I mean, can you imagine a world like that? <laughs> I can. Samoa Joe's got the Mrs. title, yay! Samoa and Joe. <laughs> oh, that's it for this episode, people. RVD. RVD. New champion! Seriously, three move three episodes, three new champions. Fuck! It's a beautiful feeling. But yeah, now like, comment, subscribe, and I'll catch y'all later.